<laughs> you know, I tried to tell y'all. I tried to tell y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm sitting on Thanksgiving. It's Thanksgiving Eve. Stomach's full. I've eaten very well. Spent a beautiful time with my family. My sister Carmen hooked me up. You know what I'm saying? Very, very good evening. Hold on. You know what happened? As if I needed another reason to laugh. As if I needed another reason to smile. Josh Allen, some second year quarterback, rolls in the Jerry world looking like the second coming of Joe Montana. Oh, I'm sorry, Lamar Jackson. <laughs> you know, first take gonna be beautiful tomorrow. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I was tired, I was sleepy. But not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> hey y'all! How about them cowboys? <laughs> I'll see y'all tomorrow. Oh, I'll see y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come up with something. I don't know what yet, but I'm gonna come up with something. I'm gonna say it again for you. How about them cowboys? <laughs> Ain't this what they've been waiting for? You ready? A mediocre team and big D. How about them cowboys? Cause some way, somehow, when it counts, that will let you down. Accident waiting to happen, it will happen. In the search of the sass! <laughs> hey beast of the east beast of the east i know you're going to be typing right now but remember when you said you're going to win the division remember when cowboy face and self of heavens 88 and that other boys out there said the girl was going to win the division Where we at now? <laughs> Y'all lost to the Bills. 26 to 15. Sorry, I had to 
go get some breakfast for the fam. But that don't mean I ain't gonna celebrate this loss for the <laughs> Let me tell you guys something. At the beginning of the season, you all said that this Dallas Cowboy team was a Super Bowl winning team. <laughs> Deuce bag for life. You know who I'm talking about. With Beast of the East, with South of Heaven's 88, with Cowboy Face, with Gerard Johnson, with Mark Holmes, Michael Anthony Fitness, Cowboys Legends for Life. Cowboys off horn, JJ through the old cat, and all you other disgusting nosy, you know, mad cowboy fans. Y'all said that y'all was going to the Super Bowl this year. You got Randall Cobb, you got Mark Koo, you got Chase Witten, you got Mike Beatty, you got Zeke, Zeke, Zeke. This closest staying to Cabo before he got his money. Demarcus Lawrence. You got Dak Prescott, who in your mind is so much better than Wentz. So much better than Wentz. Yet Wentz got his contract. Dak Prescott didn't. You guys said that the Dallas Cowboys was a Super Bowl winning team. And yet, let's review your season. You may have beaten us. Because I know y'all going to say, well, we beat you guys. Okay, fine. Congratulations. You beat us when we was in wounded. You beat a dog when he was down. But let's review how the big dogs of the yard, which is you, how did you guys do? Hmm. You guys was 3-0. 3-0 when you beat the Giants, the Redskins, and the Dolphins. Right? 3-0. You guys could have went on a run. You guys could have stopped us. And, well, you did stop us. You could have stopped the San Francisco 49ers. Yeah. The San Francisco 49ers, Green Bay, and the Saints to not be on top of your asses. You could have stopped the San Francisco 49ers, stopped them from being the number one seed. But you failed. That's what I said to you, Beast of the East. You failed. Because you lost to the Saints without Drew Brees. You lost. To your daddy, Green Bay. And then, and then, <laughs> you lost to the winless at the time, the winless Jacks. And then, the guy who says you guys own Kirk Cousins. He beat you! <laughs> the Minnesota Vikings with Kirk Cousins beat you. <laughs> then y'all lost to the Patriots. And now! And now! Add the, add the Buffalo Bills. Bills Mafia! To see. <laughs> I, I just want to know how it feels to be a Cowboy fan. That, that's what I want to know. How does it feel? Jerry Jones ain't going to fire J Jason Garrett for a long time. He says, Ariel, oh, that's my boy. Weeping boy, that's my son. I'm gonna be with him for a long, long time. He's gonna be Miss Clapper for a long, long time. Cause I'm Jerry Jones, damn it. I run a Maddox team. 
I run a mail team. And if I say that Jason Garrett is going to have a coaching job for the rest of his life, then that's what it comes to you. Because I'm Jerry Jones, damn it. And this is my league. Get with it. <sighs> Y'all suck. Y'all have screaming in your locker room. You have screaming in your locker room. Take a listen. What's going on after these last few days? Well, the first thing, every loss is terrible news at home. It's just, at least you have your wife and your family around. You had screaming in your locker room, Jerry Jones, teary eyed. You had all of that? And you think you're going to go to Chi Town, Chicago, and think you're going to get a win? You think you're going to go let the Rams in your house? Y'all think y'all gonna get revenge on the Rams? The way y'all playing? And then you think that you're gonna come here to the city of brotherly love, Philadelphia, and get a win? You think you're coming to my backyard to get a win? Uh-uh. There will be no cowboy winning in this city. Sorry, you're not getting a win here. So you're going to lose your next three games. While we beat ours. <laughs> Woo! And yeah, you can say all you want. Oh, Carson Wentz playing a bad year. Oh, Carson Wentz. Oh, he ain't an elite quarterback. Oh, Carson Wentz. He ain't better than Dak. Oh, the Eagles. They ain't better than the Cowboys. Eagles fans. Y'all suck. You support trash. You this. You that. Y'all stink. Y'all ain't going to the playoffs. Y'all ain't going to the playoffs. you do it, man. Boom, you do it. Damn it, you do it. Yes. Yes. Do all that all you want. Do all that all you want. But look at yourself in the mirror and ask yourself, what the heck is your team doing? If my team sucks, if my quarterback sucks, if my city sucks, then what's your team doing? What's your quarterback doing? What's your city doing? You are better than not we are. We didn't lose to the Bills. We didn't lose to the Jets. We didn't lose to Green Bay. Like you, we beat them. We both lost to Minnesota. We both lost to the Patriots. We are going to beat the, the Redskins again. We are going to beat the Giants twice. We are going to beat the Dolphins. We didn't lose to the Saints. Y'all did. That's the reason why Dak Prescott hasn't signed his contract yet. He's like, what the hell am I doing with Jason Cheerleader Garrett as my head coach? It is laughable to me that at the beginning of the season, you all said Super Bowl, 
You all say y'all win the division. Y'all go to the playoffs. Y'all go to the Super Bowl. Yeah, look at y'all now. Look at y'all now. Look at y'all now. You're in the same predicament we are. You're at the same predicament as us. And it's laughable. It is laughable that you guys are now at the same position as my birds. <laughs> so I need to know, cowboy fans. I need to know. Are you still them boys? Y'all think y'all gonna beat the Bears and the Rams and them birds? The way y'all playing? Y'all think y'all gonna win the division? Comment on the comment section right now and tell me why y'all think y'all win the division the way y'all played. Y'all lost to the Bills! We beat their ass! Y'all lost to Green Bay! We beat their ass! Y'all lost to the Jets! We terminated them, motherfuckers! Tell me! Explain to me how you guys think y'all gonna win the division the way y'all played the last two games. And don't think the Bears gonna take it, gonna just lay down. Don't think for one second that the Bears are just gonna lay down for you. Don't think that they're just gonna say, oh, okay, oh, y'all suffering? You Cowboys think y'all suffering? Okay, here you go. Here's a big old piece of pie, a big old L from the Bears. We lose, y'all win. Blah, blah, blah. No, 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 the Bears ain't gonna give up. The Bears ain't gonna quit. They won, y'all lost. <laughs> That's confidence right there in Shy Town. That's confidence. And you're going in their house. Probably gonna rain there, uh oh. Probably gonna snow there, uh oh. <laughs> Dad probably won't be able to see the snow. We don't know. <laughs> oh, I love this. I love this. I really love this. I don't know about y'all, but I love this. So in close. Because I had so much fun talking and rubbing in the face of all you disgusting, nosy, eating, eating on my dang no cowboy fans. <laughs> When I say we're the best thing going today, I meant it. When I say y'all suck, I meant it. You ain't gonna be Chicago or the Rams. Not gonna do it. Your day sure in this city ain't gonna beat us. You're gonna lose. We're gonna win. We're gonna go to the playoffs. Whatever happens, happens. I said along with E-Rock and the rest of the Eagles Nation, we don't want to talk about playoffs. Because we had that, we lost to Seattle. But then we saw you guys. <laughs> then we saw you guys. And y'all gave us hope. The Eagles fans, we wasn't worried about the playoffs after that loss against Seattle. But then you guys gave us hope by losing to a team who we beat. <laughs> Y'all lost to the Bills? We beat the Bills, and y'all gave us hope. You gave Eagle fans hope. Beast of the East, you gave Eagle fans hope. South Heaven 88, you gave Eagle fans hope. Cowboy Face, you gave Eagle fans hope. That other guy, you, you know. Mm, what are you doing with the man, boy? That coming at you with the nest. You gave Eagle fans hope. Cowboy fans, you gave Eagle fans hope after you lost to the Bills. So thank you. I appreciate it. Fly Eagle Slide. Now hit the music. One more time. How about them cowboys? Cause some way, somehow, when it counts, Dak will let you down. Accident.
did wait to happen, it would happen. And that's what I'm saying. Ain't this what they've been waiting for? You ready?